Did you know there's 40 species of soldier beetle? <laughs> I did not. Uh, I want to find a baby lapwing. Please. Why? Um, because they're adorable. First time going up onto Yorkshire Moorland today, properly, and we saw, oh, I don't know, 10 of them? Yeah, probably. They're beautiful, and their yeah. call is wonderful. Today is the 14th of July, mm -hmm. and I think we're going to start looking for baby lapwings. Does that sound good? Yeah. Cool. Are you excited? Yeah. Look at that chap. What is it? Grouse. So this is the male. It's cool. Because he's got what's wrong? Well, he's completely black and he's got like a red. Yeah, the eyebrow, right? Yeah. So you talked to you talked about lecking the other day. But it's where they they look like red deer. They spar. I didn't realise! I, c I couldn't hear what you were saying because you were whispering so quietly. They're very, very sensitive to sound. Uh -huh. Well, you did see it. Yeah. This is where lots of lapwings live, so it's yeah. a good chance of seeing a baby one. There's an oyster sketch on the wall, Will. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, I haven't seen one before. Oh, I love its beak. Its beak is startling. Is it's it turning to you? Us, yeah. It's, yeah, it's looking at us. No, they're on this side. I think, I think they might be over the wall. No, there, there it is. It's flying, Will. You see it's going through the sky? Oh yeah, yeah. We have actually seen a ridiculous amount. I feel very lucky. Good. We'll try again tomorrow for a lap wing. So we're getting out. So we're hoping not to get hit by the rain, but also hoping to bump into two nice species. So today is... 16th? Yeah, so this is our third day looking for the lapwing chicks. And it's, it looks like it's going to trick it down, but it's been a really lovely day. This is about the right time. Yeah. <gasps> Baby lapwing, Baby lapwing, where? You see, over there, over there, by the thistle. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There it is, there it is, there it is. Oh, it's adorable. Literally just a tinier, fluffier version of the lap Because you told me they're precocial chicks. We can go a bit further. I'd quite like to go a little bit further. Let's see what else we can see. Oh, yeah. Is it going to sit up again, do you think? We've got it. It's so close by. Maybe we just want to go. Oh, wow. Can you see that? That was magical. <laughs> That was, that was proper cool. And their ears, they're so, I don't know, communicative. <laughs> you got wonderful ears, so much character. I've never been that close to one before. Well, the first one was only the other night. <laughs> Second hair. Second hair. You'll see it in a sec, it's very, very well camouflage. Stop. Alicia, oh, there's a stoat crossing the road behind her. <laughs> <laughs> stoat! Look at you saw a little stoat. But it was in, it's in my mirror. Can't see anymore. Anyway, it's a grass. Wow! I don't pivot. <laughs> what a view. Are you, are you happy? Yeah, I, I'm very happy. I've seen far more than I ever expected out here. In fairness, I didn't know about black grouse at all until we came up here. They're stunning, really, really stunning mm -hmm. creatures. The hairs were fantastic. So, so were the lapping chicks the highlight, or I feel, I feel like the hairs might have surpassed oh, it. To be honest, honestly, the, I think the hair stole it at the last moment, which, uh, which seems a bit unfair because, uh, yeah, the whole premise of this little short was that we'd see some lapwing chicks. We did saw some lapwing chicks, and they were adorable, just as fluffy as I anticipated. I hope I see more on the way back. Hope, yeah. we, see, hope we see them again. The more is so much more than you could ever expect, really, in every aspect. Still very lucky. Thank you. That's all right. Thank you. <laughs>